family, it's Lotus here from Lotus Holistic Healing and on YouTube at Goddess Jasmine Lotus. Today we're going to review and do a taste test of the Baker Creek Butter Wax Bean. So that's a delicious bean that you can eat like a snap bean, fresh. And this is my first time growing it. It grew extremely quickly. I planted the seeds on May 1st. So I planted on May 1st and we've already got these beautiful, beautiful golden beans. This one is definitely ready to be eaten. We have a couple small ones in here too. Some other big ones. And it's my first time growing this variety. It is from Baker Creek. And while you're looking at them, I will give you a quick description from the Baker Creek Whole Seed Catalog. Here's the Baker Creek Whole Seed Catalog. And the beans we're trying today are not the beans climbing up the trellis. We are climbing the bush bean that's at the bottom of the trellis. You'll see it's a little lighter. Our 1500 year old cave beans are climbing the trellis and they have not sprouted yet. So, the description in the Baker Creek Magazine is bush bean 50 days, which was about accurate for us. We planted on May 1st and we just had the first beans a couple days ago. And it is, it says it's an old favorite that has been praised by gardeners for superior flavor, impressive yield, there are lots, natural disease resistance, and it is a lot healthier and less eaten up than my other beans. And let's see what else. Oh, since the 1800s, Golden Butter Wax Bean was originally produced by D.M. Ferry & Co. in 1876. Oodles of five inch long bright yellow beans are produced on a compact 16 to 18 inch tall plant that remains upright and sturdy. Excellent choice for canning and freezing. So maybe we'll do some canning and freezing. Uh, right now we're gonna eat them fresh. So let's do our taste test. Let's hear that snap first. Oh, I thought it'd be a little more snappy. So first thing, they're a little fuzzy on the outside, like they feel fuzzy. Mm. That was really sweet. It's not stringy, which is good. Mm. Mm. I really like these. They're super sweet and juicy. We're actually gonna have the cameraman try one. <laughs> That's Will. That's Bay over there. <laughs> That's not bad for. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> so, there you have it. Yeah, we think it would be better cooked, but it is still nice and juicy, fresh. It's a really beautiful plant as well, as you can see here. The flowers are really pretty. See right there is another one. I'm actually gonna eat another one. I think we'll save the rest for cooking, but I really like this. <laughs> that crunch. <laughs> okay, so there you have it. The Golden Butter Wax Bean from Baker Creek. I really like it. It was super easy to grow, super healthy. It grew really well, even with so many other bean plants in the same pot. We got two of the, um, oh, we got more than two. We've got four of the Golden Butter Wax Bean there. So I'll grow it again. I do prefer to grow heirloom varieties that are ancient. Uh, I guess I didn't really look that up when I was getting this bean, so that would be my my one downside to it. I usually like the older varieties, but it was really yummy. It's pretty, and we are really excited for this 1,500-year-old cave bean, which you will surely, surely get a taste test, review, all that. This is the thing that I'm most excited for in my garden this year, and there's more. 
I guess this has become the bean video. You guys get some extras. Oh my God, just look at my garden. This is on our apar apartment patio. Here's the little extra stuff you get for watching. Watching all the way through. Mix in some dirt, cause we've got those pots over there. And yes, it is a mess. I know it's a mess. Our borage about to bloom. It always falls over when it's in um, containers, what I've found. We've got mullein drying up here, which is pretty cool. Mullein's just drying on the trellis. And these are all beans back here. That's our 1500 year old cape being climbing. Um, yeah, here's the garden. Happy solar solstice, everyone. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you have tried the golden butter wax bean before, if you like it. Likes, dislikes, tips on growing. Thanks so much for watching. I love you guys. Please like, follow, subscribe, share, whatever all those words are. Bye!